Hey everybody, Colnar here, and welcome back to more SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom. And welcome to the original game here. Yes, this is the original SpongeBob SquarePants game, and um, as you can see, my analog stick is not. My controller does not want to be my friend, but now I got a control. So I thought I'd just show you guys what the original game looked like if you never played it. So here are the wooden tiki's. Yeah, just look at this. It's all different. Here's Patrick. Did you find my lock? Not yet. Oh. Now that's a glitch. I have found every sock. That's why it's 100%. But yeah, that is actually a glitch. I glitched Patrick. And that's hilarious. So I'm going to show you what SpongeBob's house looks like in the original version of this game. <clears throat> and I will also show you other things. So this is SpongeBob's closet. This is kitchen. I make myself a snack. But there's no time. The bathroom. There's a TV. Maybe a little bounce on the old bed. This is what his bedroom looked like. And look at that. This picture has him and Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. But in the newer game, it just has him. This is where I keep all my old comic books. <clears throat> as a, a greaser. With a, it's SpongeBob with the greaser hair. See the buttons. <clears throat> the buttons they mainly stayed the same. And yeah, as you can see, that hasn't changed. A lot of different visuals. So we're just gonna move along here. <clears throat> There's a SpongeBob Arena entrance. Here's the Chum Bucket, Mr. Krabs, oh, here's the entrance to Spongebob's Dream. Now, now here is the uh, movie theater. <coughs> now I'm going to show you what, what originally was in the movie theater. So yeah, concept art for Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom. Now this is the original Squidward boss fight, and now it's in the multiplayer of uh, Battle for Bikini Bottom. There's Spongebob as Mermaid Man. And there's Spongebob as, a uh, as I guess, Tarzan. There's Sandy's Tree Dome. Here's Sand Mountain. There's the fight with Sandy. Well, Robot Sandy. And there's Sandy's Dream. Here's Rock Bottom. I guess that's concept art of a uh, Rock Bottom Citizen. <coughs> um, all Rock Bottom Citizens concept art. Now, there's the two blitz concept art 
And there's Chuck concept art. Arf and Arf Dog concept art. Sleepy Time concept art. <coughs> no, <laughs> I don't know what that R is for. I think I think it's Chuck, maybe. I'm not sure. And there's there's G Love or Glove. There's Tartar. Hammer. And then there's concept art for the Tiki's. The, um, the regular Tiki, the Shh Tiki, uh, the Stone Tiki, the uh, Lightning Tiki, and also the Floating Tiki. There's Prawn. Here's concept art of the, the Industrial Park. And then there's a uh, concept art of Mr. Krabs' dream. And there's more concept art of that. Concept art of the Mermelair. <clears throat> more robot concept art. This is the Kelp Forest, I believe. More of the Kelp Forest. There's Jellyfish Fields. <coughs> look, and Patrick looks like he's carrying the Health Inspector. I mean, he does look like him. And here's Concept Art of Fuel Lagoon. Concept Art of um, Sand Mountain. And there's concept art of a uh, Flying Dutchman's Graveyard. More of the Flying Dutchman's Graveyard. Uh, concept art of the Duplicatortron 3000. Concept art of a giant Godzilla robot. And that's it. And look, there's that guy. Yeah, there are actually sound effects if you hit a person <clears throat> like Mr. Krabs or Patrick or Squidward. And that movie theater is also 40,000 shiny objects. Now, speaking of shiny objects, I want to show you Mr. Krabs' shiny objects. Now, for Mr. Krabs, 3,000, 3,500, 4,000, 4,500, 5,000, 5,500, 6,500, 7,500. Why couldn't they just go like this instead of just increasing it by 3,000? I mean, it's annoying. <coughs> There's Plankton. Now, I'm going to try and quickly show you guys the visuals of each person's house as well as visuals for jellyfish fields. So here's Squidward's house. Hey Squidward! Didn't I pay you to go away? So that was Squidward's house. <coughs> now we're going to Patrick's house. And look, there's that um, record player I was showing you. A little ton, you guys. That's Patrick's Rock. Now 
Now we're going to go to Sandy Street Home. This is Sandy Street Home. <coughs> and there's Patrick there spying on us with a drinking a milkshake or something. As you can see, I'm probably going a lot fast, or fat, really fast. It's just because I want to. Going to the police station. You're looking here, it's a machine. That has all the robots like Fodder, G Love, Chuck, Bombot, Arf, <clears throat> Arf Dog, Bizbot, <coughs> Tub Tublet, Monsoon, Hammer, Tartar, Sleepy Time. Slick, Chomp Bot, and Plankton. So yeah. Robots obviously gotta get upgrade in the remaster. Crusty Crab. <coughs> and there are those Thunder Tees. Look at them, the mime. the crusty crab <coughs> Jesus flash yeah, that falls down and it breaks. Yes, but they don't serve love. There's the entrance to Patrick's lab. Now, wait, did I say Patrick's lab? I meant Plankton's lab. Now I'm going to show you guys Jellyfish Fields and what it looked like back on the good old PlayStation 2. Thank you. 
Look, look. Look at jellyfish fields. Changes here, people. <clears throat> now we're gonna. Now I'm gonna show you downtown Bikini Bottom. Now look at Sandy. Trying to see the difference, guys. So yeah, that's down, that's downtown Bikini Bottom. <laughs> now here's Goo Lagoon. Oh, there's a hammer. <coughs> Oh look, a monsoon. Now did you get a taste of that? I'm gonna show you rock bottom now. Now I will show you the boss fights fights later on, but first we're gonna do all the main worlds. Now here's rock bottom. Look, tartar sauce. Much easy to hit. Ooh, shiny object. Now we're gonna go to the Mermel Lair. Just look at this, guys. Isn't this so different?
As you can see, much easier in the older version. Sand Mountain. There's what Sand Mountain looks like. Kelp Forest. I'm going to show you what the Kelp Forest looks like. Something that that leaf hurts you. I don't know why. Like, like, look at look at the kelp forest. It looks so dark. I do see the differences in these games. Like, there are, there's not a whole lot of, uh, enemies here. the kelp forest down to the flying dutchman's graveyard So yeah, that was the Flying Dutchman's Graveyard now for Spongebob's Dream. I just want to show you guys a little, you know, what they looked like back on the PlayStation 2, those level. Now for the boss fights, oh boy. They are pretty different too. 
as I as I'll show you. So here's the robot Sandy boss fight. <laughs> Basically the easiest one of them all. Looks like the robot's left itself vulnerable. Great barrier reef. Now the robot's taking a beating out there. losing its head what a shocking takedown by Patrick She does do the swipe, okay. Just just checking something. She does do the swipe. I didn't take any damage, haha. Uh -huh. It was a glitch. the basis of that fight. <clears throat> so now I'm going to show you the robot Patrick fight. Ah! Yikes! Looks like SpongeBob's in for a rough ride! Now look at Patrick's shorts as you see it's they're they're black with a red skull on it. As in the remaster, it's green with a red skull on it. Look at that! The robot's made himself dizzy! That's the ticket! <laughs> Say hello to my I wonder if I can use a cruise bubble against Patrick. <laughs> Yeah, as soon as he hits you, you gotta redo it. That's the ticket! 
You can hit him with a cruise bubble. <laughs> Hilarious. SpongeBob on Frozen. Oh, look at that! Drops three boxes. As the new one drops go. only one. Okay, I don't know how I got hit right there. I died. Yeah, that sucks. What is Sandy going to do to get SpongeBob on Frozen? I thought I got out of there, but no. Great Barrier Reef. Look at that! The robots made himself dizzy. That's the ticket. That hot goo could melt anything. I died again. I didn't double jump. I thought I double jump, but no. This game is making me angry. And you know what? I'm not editing any of this crap out. <coughs> I'm keeping it in. Besides, you guys wanted a long video. Here's your long video. Look at that! The robots made himself dizzy! That's the ticket! That hot goo could melt anything! The robot is down. The robot is down. 
<laughs> that does it. SpongeBob is back in the fight. Okay, that was BS right there. Yeah, that's basically what you do for that fight. Now, finally, the chum bucket fight. Looks like SpongeBob may have a moment to act here. SpongeBob has an opening. But will he get the drop on the robot? There's another opportunity for SpongeBob! Alright, here's Robot Plankton's full shooting machine. The robot better change tactics and fast! That's the ticket! Suck it to him, SpongeBob! Oh, and the robot is down! As you can see, I got him with the explosion on my cruise ball. better change tactics and fast. Oh, the the I guess SpongeBob won't be winning that way. Yeah, I was getting greedy right I there. Guess SpongeBob won't be winning that way. Dodger Robot Plankton. That's it! Now issue the coup de grace! Right in the nose, I failed. Got him. Yikes! Looks like.
Spongebob, Spongebob, he just flew into your head. Well, then I'm going to follow him into my head. I mean, into my robot version's head, which is like my head, but bigger and more metallic. Will you go already? Here I come, robot plankton. This is just getting too weird for me. Will SpongeBob be able to neutralize the giant robot's brain? Or will SpongeBob go home defeated and dejected? Stay tuned! So yeah, this is the final boss area. Well, the final boss area, I guess. For the original game. Got him! SpongeBob! SpongeBob, hit the Yeah, this is why I thought that this, like the original version of the final boss was hard. That's the ticket! This match is just about over. Eh, uh, just about over, my boy. There's Monsoon. Sucks is there's no health regeneration. You know, I just say screw it. Just use a cruise missile. Then go fight the robot. Yeah, that's why I hate about Robot Plankton. He'll move at the last second. When you think you got him. Like, look at this crap. Oh, I can't watch! Okay, maybe just a little. Well, that's great. I'm down to my last three pairs of underwear. Better not lose any more health. Oh, I was no. Or should I say the fish entity? That was a liar, liar, pants on fire. Yeah, those things will hurt you. But sometimes I feel like I'm not a man. I'm being played. So I only have two pairs of underwear left and I worked too hard to get here. Gotcha. And the robot is down. Nice move by SpongeBob. This match is just about over.
This is getting ridiculous. You need to stand still. You won't stand still. Look, he's in the same place as before. If SpongeBob could just get past that robot brain's armored shell. I missed. And uh and not like in the remaster, if you miss, you have to destroy Plankton again. Cry, cry, weep, weep. They're probably asking yourself, can you just hit him again? Yeah, but I don't want to risk losing another life. Or... A cruise bubble down one of those brain holes would be very prudent about now. Whoa, he was coming up in my space. Gotcha. Oh, what an opening for a guy literally filled with openings. That's there we go. It. Move by SpongeBob. This match is just about over. Yes, sir. That's it. Now issue the coup de grace. I will, and here we are. And boom, that's how you beat that. I'm becoming a lawyer. You haven't defeated me yet. I still have lots of robots all over Bikini Bottom. I'll summon them all, and then we'll see. Uh oh. I'll destroy you. You'll destroy me. I'll destroy you. I'll destroy you twice as hard. Oh yeah? I'll destroy you plus one. Well, I'll destroy you plus infinity. Shut up, you stupid robot! Who are you calling stupid? I went to community college, you oversized puppy grinder! Oh yeah? I'll show you! Come here and fight like a monster. Well, Plankton, I hope you learned your lesson. Oh, I certainly did! Next time, I'll get it right! <laughs> Ouch! We won! Who wants to get ice cream? I do! I do! Need I remind you all that there are so many <coughs> that are making a mess of Bikini Bottom? Sandy is right. Well, I thought she was a squirrel. I'm being punished. I don't know for what, but I'm being punished. There's still work to be done out there. Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy wouldn't stop, and neither will I. We can't rest until Bikini Bottom is safe. So yeah, guys, that's uh, that's that. And then you get the you ready, thing kids? again. Aye, aye, I can't hear you.
So yeah, basically, 100% the game, you get that. And yeah, Spongebob Arena, I know I hit triangle, so don't judge me. But yeah guys, that's it for Spongebob. Now uh, stay tuned to this channel for my next Let's Play, because it's going to be epic. So thank you, <coughs> thank you guys for watching. If you like this, hit a like on it. Subscribe if you're new to this channel. And I shall see you guys next time for more. Well, I'll see you guys next time on my next Let's Play. So, yeah. I'll see you guys later.